Hey there, you must be Joe. How you doing? Mike Riches, Long and Foster Real Estate. Now, your last name, Exotic, right? All right, I just want to make sure I'm pronouncing it correctly. All right, well, welcome. Let's go take a look. That's an interesting haircut. You don't really see that much anymore, or ever. I like those earrings, too. Those are cool. And this is your spacious living room. As you can see, there's plenty of room to spread out with your family or whatever pets you may have. I'm sorry, what's the name? Baskin? Carol Baskin. I don't know her. Is she a realtor? Really? Wow, she sounds terrible. So what brings you from Oklahoma to Delaware? Oh, it's a secret? Oh, well, that's normal. No, I agree. Carol sounds terrible. Let me show you this dining room. Um, I'm sorry, I can't help you with that. I'm a realtor, not a hitman. And this is the master bedroom. This is where the magic happens, so to speak. The best part about this master bedroom, there's plenty of room for you and all your straight husbands. There's a fire at your place? And you were out of town when this happened? Excuse me. The inside job. No, 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 just allergies. And look at this spacious master bathroom. Double sinks that'll be perfect for brushing your teeth no matter how many you have left. Jeff Lowe. Um, doesn't ring a bell. Is he a realtor? A 50-year-old man that dresses like an 11-year-old skater girl. No. And this is the kitchen. Lots of natural light in here. Corian countertops. Stainless steel wolf range. I mean, sure you can cook pizzas with expired meat from Walmart. It's your oven. I'm sure a lot of people do that around here. Joe, let me show you this powder room. So yeah, this home is staged, uh, much like that fire at your place. Oh, no, no, I said look at this fireplace. <laughs> do you smell sardine oil? It smells like it's coming from that foot. Joe, is there someone you can talk to about Carol? Like, this doesn't seem healthy. Yeah, I do it all the time with my kids. I'm pretty good at math. Oh, math. No, 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 I never touch this stuff. And look at this amazing backyard. Yeah, I'm sure you can have cats. I mean, it's just a normal house pet. I mean, how big are we talking? Like a, like a big cat, like an overweight cat, like just a jungle cat, a tiger, like a real tiger, 227 tigers. You know what? I got a copy of the deed restrictions inside. Let's just go take a look at those. Yada, yada, yada. No fences over six feet, no commercial vehicles, blah, blah, blah. I don't see anything in here that says you can't have 200 tigers. Um, I have no idea if you're allowed to start a zoo or not. Um, I would just sign on the dotted line, get the settlement, and then work it out with the Homeowners Association after that. Hey Joe, pleasure meeting you. Thanks so much for coming by. Let me know if you have any questions. I'd love to help out. Take care, bud. Hey Joe, by the way, I would drop all that stuff with Carol, man. It's going to ruin your life. You're going to lose everything and probably go to prison.